Exterior. Beach. Day. I see a man walking along the beach. At first I can't see his face, but I can tell that there's something about him that's different, yet familiar. He turns around, and I'm surprised to see myself, my own face. And for the first time, I believe this moment to be possible, that I could have the close-up. Not the chiseled blonde or the quirky brunette, but a gay Asian musical comedian from Canada. And cut. <sighs> this is going well. Yeah. I'm really glad you're doing this, Kevin. Oh, thanks, girl. <laughs> Just throwing something professional looking together so that I can submit it to film festivals and get in front of industry. <laughs> it's this or starting a podcast. They'll love it. Diversity is so in. Plus, I hear like minorities are taking over Hollywood. Okay, <laughs> you're doing racism again. But my Hollywood talent manager is so excited. He thinks this is a great idea. Kevin, you're a gay Asian musical comedian from Canada. That's so many things Thanks. that nobody wants. Oh, It's too much. You gotta fit in a box. I mean, I could get you auditions for gay roles, but they're going to straight guys so they can win Golden Globes. And I could get you auditions for Asian roles, but there's no such thing. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> So, he told me that one of his clients booked a CW series after making a short film about her struggles in the industry. Well, I'm a victim too, and I want that. I know you've been making YouTube videos unsuccessfully for over 10 years, but real short films cost real money. Oh, I'll just do a Kickstarter. That always works. <laughs> but you're right, people can tell when you skimp on costs, especially on sound. A good sound guy is so important. A good sound guy is so important. If you're gonna do the short film, you have to casually showcase everything you do. Like you were signed to a major record label once, huh? You were a Broadway chorus boy. That's awesome. You need to casually and inconspicuously throw in some singing and dancing. This is 16 bars of me singing a song. It's 16 bars of him singing a song. This is 16 of me singing a song and I'm bouncing high and low hitting every note to an original song that I produced and wrote this is 16 bars of me singing a song I counted that in 4-4 four, four. okay just be careful about songs Hollywood producers don't think musical theater actors can be subtle enough to be on camera. <gasps> I can be subtle! Okay, but should there be like a story to this short film? Well, make it about you. About your experience as a gay Asian musical comedian from Canada, living in America. Legally. Something funny and personal and heartfelt and honest, yet a little bit sexy. Okay, maybe it can be about being a professional performer since I was six years old being told that if I work hard and I train hard, that I'll go far. And it works at first, but then I come out of the closet and suddenly I'm too gay to play straight roles and gay roles go to straight guys so they can win Golden Globes. And I work for years, but there's only so far I can go. I hit a wall, so I quit. And I sell everything I own so that I can pursue my own voice, my own story with these comedy songs I've written my entire life. Now I'm a comedian, but people call me an alt comic who doesn't do real stand up and will never be on late night. One day I'm touring through Arkansas and I look in the mirror and I'm suddenly too old to be wearing graphic tees. I don't have enough friends to crowdsource my healthcare bill if I ever get cancer. I barely see my family or have any romantic relationships of any substance because I'm married to my work. And a sudden fear comes over me. What if all my work never amounts to anything? What if I 
never find an audience? What if society simply doesn't want to hear from a gay, Asian, musical comedian from Canada? Right. But you know, relatable to middle America. And definitely don't make it meta. People hate that. Damn it! I forgot about that. Well, I guess this is a wrap. I have to go rewrite the script, so. You can go. Okay. Cool. So wrap everyone. I'm giving gifts. Do I meet back at noon? Do you guys need? Okay. I wrote this movie, yeah, I made it. Starring me, my choreography. This movie, I produced it. Edit and direct it all by me. Here are some actors.